trying to get a full on beard, but uh, not looking too good. Let's talk about anime. The last time I talked about anime was when we talked about Darling in the Franks, episode 15. Before I went to shit. <laughs> Eden Zero is a new anime Hiromashima is working on. It's pretty good. So we're gonna talk about manga. The first chapter, discussion, review, whatever the hell you wanna call it. Let's just talk about it. Here's my first impressions of the book, of the first chapter, and yeah. First thing that piqued my interest, the why the reason why I want to talk about Eden Zero is because it's um it's because it's very similar to um to this one manga anime. I'm not sure if you guys have heard, but it's called Fairy Tale. Very, very similar. It's not even a joke on how much the, the characters are alike. It's Natsu and Grey fused together. It's Lucy, it's fucking happy, Urza. Everyone. I mean, it's his manga. He could do whatever the hell he wants. He could make. He could take to some the same models of the characters if he wants to. His art style is not bad. His art style is good. I like his art style. But you know, it's the fucking same. I mean, <laughs> so I want to go to read this uh, the first chapter because I want to see how similar it would be since it, it's similar with its character models. I wonder how similar it'd be with the story. And it kind of was. It, it really was. <laughs> the first chapter. Don't get me wrong. Was pretty decent. It was okay. It wasn't bad. It wasn't a surprise like, oh my god, this manga is so good. But it was decent for Hiramashima. It's, it was good because of the whole plot twist at the end where they're in space and shit. That's interesting. So what's the story? What is this Eden Zero about? What is it about? Why is it called Eden Zero? What is the story? Who are the characters? So the story so far is about Shiki, Rebecca, and Happy. Yes, the cat's name is Happy. Not any of you joking. His name is Happy. His name is fucking Happy. Just like the one in Fairy Tale. Going through a journey through space. That's it. That's literally all we're given. They're probably gonna go through space, encounter tough enemies, meet people, befriend them, become best friends, and then go through hardship because they're friends. They're gonna beat tough enemies with the power of friendship. The word friendship and friendship just triggers me. It, it triggers me. That's what Fairy Tale has done. It, it, the word friendship. It's something so cliche that Fairy Tale has just managed to make a trigger word out of it. It just triggers me. Friendship, friends, it's, it's, it's You can have friends, friendship, the word, the, the whole friend, friend premise in your manga. You just can't make it have the power of friendship beats everything. Like that's some bullshit. That's not, that's not true. It triggers me. It shouldn't trigger me as much, but it does. It's just, it triggers me so. Uh, <laughs> friendship. Uh, this is all Fairy Tale's fault, all right? This is all this is all its fault, all right? My God. So the main character Shiki has this power called Ether Gear, which gives him power with gravity and shit. It's pretty cool, interesting. He's the son of the Demon King or the grandson of the Demon King, and that's where he got this power from. That's all we know so far. I read the second chapter of it. The second chapter is a whole lot better. It was good. It, it got better in the first chapter than Eden Zero chapter one. It was better. It was cool. It set up the relationship between Rebecca and Happy, their bonds together, the power of friends. I I, I know, friends, fuck. Ah. But it was a nice, cool chapter feelings with Rebecca being alone and Happy being alone. They find each other and, um, oh wait, I should have put this in the beginning of the video. SPOILERS! Happy dies. He's in an accident. He's pretty much dead. Then he repairs himself, and then Rebecca, Rebecca, Rebecca got inspired by Dante. I mean, come on. Happy turns into these two guns. Rebecca starts blasting fucking scrubs left and right. Wow. Um, I mean, despite the whole Happy's a robot and guns and weapons and shit, this whole soul eater shit, it's pretty cool. I mean, it's not original, but it was cool. It was it was cool. It was nice. It was it was decent. I liked it some for some reason. I'm not sure what else to to expect from it. Do I expect much from his work from this new Eden Zero? Mm, not really. I, I don't really expect that much. The problem with Fairy Tale is that his writing was shit. Will he learn from it? I don't know. I really don't know. Brave Master was amazing. I love Brave Master. That was the first legit manga I ever read when I found out, oh, he made Fairy Tale too. Cool. I'm gonna jump into that. It started off good, 
and then, oh no, it was total shit. It could be the same here. It could be good, it could be total shit, or it could be good, shit, and then really good. Or good, and then just good. Good all the way. It could be a nice, decent manga, actually, all right? I want him to succeed. I want him to do an actual cool manga, all right? Fairytale had a nice premise. I like the whole fantasy thing, wizards, magic, dragons, all that. It was cool, it was a cool premise. I like that fantasy stuff, all right? It's cool. It, it could have been better. Fairy tale could have been something cool, amazing. I mean, it's still cool. It's still decent, but you know, it could have been a whole lot better. I like his art style. I like the plot twist at the end of the first chapter. And of course, at the chapter two uh, plot twist where Happy's a fucking gun. I guess the things that I really still don't like about this chapter or this whole series in general is that it has the word friends. <laughs> that, that's a personal a personal little uh, pet peeve of mine friends um, the same character models I even, saw, I even saw Levy and those two guys that are with Levy models there I mean they were there I thought they were gonna be a, a major a characters later on but no I think they were just you know Easter eggs hopefully they're just Easter eggs I mean I'm fine if they just keep this save the fate the the models of these main characters the same and the rest of the cast is different like for other characters they meet in the future they're different character models and not the same and of course uh, like the first chapter of the manga was exactly like the first chapter of fairy tale except the only difference was rebecca was with happy instead of natsu being with happy or lucy being with i don't know it's a fucking uh, mm. in the fairy tale first chapter natsu was with happy and now in this one it's like lucy is with happy and they meet Shiki instead of not soon happy meeting Lucy. I don't know why I use the same models. I don't know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm enjoying it for now, but I know later on it's gonna trigger me. And once it triggers me, once it goes into like the into shit, I'm gonna talk about it and I'm gonna I'm gonna be like, I told you, I told you. But for now, I'm liking this uh this new manga. We'll just see where it goes from here. I'm not gonna make every a chapter reviews anime shit like that anime chapter reviews nothing like that i'm just gonna come back to talk if anything interesting happens if a chapter surprises me or i just want to talk a little bit more about it and i do want to bring more videos like this i do want to talk more about manga because i do have some personal mangas not personal mangas i do have some personal favorite mangas that i would like to talk about so yeah the word of friendship still triggers me still triggers me a lot all right guys my name is brian so it's brian i'll see you guys next time later i have no bit i have no bit um it's yeah